Hey guys, Ali. Whoa, okay. Every time I film. Hey guys, Ali here, and it's like 2 a.m. Wednesday morning, but I realize I'm leaving for camp today. So, I need to make a quick little video so I can give it to you guys today. So, I'm just gonna talk about what happened at BlakeCon, a little story time. So, Monday when I uploaded the five parts to day one, I should have mentioned, well, you probably heard me say how I forgot to bring my charger for the camera. Well, that's at least my problem, so my SD card got full, cut off the rest of the video. I thought I brought my little cord so I could hook it up to my laptop, I forgot that at home too. So I was completely screwed and I decided that I'll try to my best to remember everything that happened so I could do this video right here. So since it's 2 a.m. and I want to go back to sleep, um, well, I'm just going to hold it like this and let me get some drink because it's going to be a while. So we have my trusty little Arizona can, but we're going to start talking. So let's talk about when I got hugged by Kenny randomly. So. I really don't like sudden human contact, like even if my friends are doing something, they have to tell me beforehand if they're going to touch my hair or hug me, I have to know, because then I get freaked out. So after he suddenly hugged me, well, I just started shake, like, shaking inside, so that scared me. That's the end of that, just on that little explanation. But that's why I was freaking out now because I literally ran, well, a, ran, a YouTuber ran into me, but because, yeah. So, later on that day, I'm walking around getting bored in the expo hall. I bought a Connor Francis sweatshirt, which you might see next week on Monday. And I'm walking away from the shopping area. I think I'm going outside. And I run into this little viner, Toby Randall, who makes singing vines, and they're actually really good. So, yeah. I'll try to put everyone's links on it, whatever. But then I'm walking around again. Actually, let me get my phone so I know what order I met these people in. All my pictures of all the people I met are on Instagram, actually. I post, I blasted them on Sunday when I got home. So then um, I'm walking around in front of the expo hall, in like the front part where I have all the halls, and I run into Denzel, who's another Viner, and... Can I just add that he's like a giant compared to me? You'll see if you see the picture, but I'm so tiny compared to him. It's not even funny. And yeah. Now, at the end of the day, I'm walking around. I am decided I'm going to wait for my uncle early and walk, like, sit up front close to where there's a drop-off area. And I'm sitting there, and I'm watching the door because, like, that's the only way to sit without making awkward eye contact. And I see these group of boys walking in. And I see a familiar little snapback and glasses and jewelry and black shirt. And then at first, my like, heart jumped, but then I was like, no, there's no way it's him. Not after what has happened this, that past weekend. But then, like, some guy blocked him, so I couldn't see him. And then the guy moved, and my heart, just, like, jumped out because it's, like, out of shock. And lo and behold, holy frittata, it's Connor Fran- not Whoa, not Connor Fran. I wish it was Connor Fran. It was Carter Reynolds just walked out of the building. And after that, there's a whole bunch of drama about him being at VidCon and him getting kicked out, whatever. Of course, I took the opportunity to take a picture with him because I have my YouTuber goal pictures. Dude, I just dropped. I just threw it away. But I have my whole YouTuber who finder goals ready. I had to get it for my binder, no matter what just happened with him, I had to. But that's why, oh, no. And then I decided, you know, I'm just going to walk around and let me go get something to drink while I'm waiting. Because I, I was just sitting there an hour earlier. I'm like, I'm not going to sit in the sun for an hour. I'm going to go get a drink. And Gavin Free from Achievement Hunter slash Rooster Teeth was there. So I saw him earlier at a panel, like, randomly. But I was like, you know, he makes me laugh. I'm going to take a picture with him. And I did. And I got an autograph too, so that happened. So then, second day, I got there early because I had a Dash to Jack meet and greet. And funny story, it's the same time he, like, 
the meet and greet was at 12. He posts a video every time, every time he posts a video it's at 11.30. So like, at 11.30 me and a whole bunch of other girls meeting him in line were there and we we're looking up and he literally came out while we we're in line like, like came out like out of the closet and we were all freaking out because like I guess some people had some things planned to say to him but then th that got messed up and everyone was freaking out and then I had my little moment that I'm keeping myself because I want to and I'll probably tell you guys another day actually but yeah so then I'm walking around in the expo hall again because I'm bored and I run into Brennan Taylor and another Reiner, Reiner I can't remember his name at the moment probably because I'm tired but yeah so then I'm walking around outside again to go home and I ran into Scotty Scotty another Reiner and Gary I can't say their last names because I don't want to think that much, but I ran into them. Scotty was busy taking pictures of other people, and I was had to go run because I was actually closer to the time he was going to be able to pick me up. So I just took a picture with Gary and ran all the way to the end because I needed to rush and not get be late to being picked up. So then, oh no. That wasn't for that. I was running late to my John Cozart meet and greet because I didn't want to be in line too long. And sadly, I was in the second line, so I was there for a little bit longer. But I met him, had another little moment with him. <sighs> yeah. But look, okay, I'm going to show you this picture because this one's actually a little bit adorable. I mean, look, look, look. Oy. Okay, you can't see it, but look how adorable that is. Like, we are goals. Even though he has a girlfriend, we are goals. So I think, and then, yeah, that was it for me. After that, I didn't run into any more YouTubers because I was tired after that and I was leaving at 7 even though I finished, like, at 6 something. So I just waited outside to be picked up. So then, um, last day of VidCon, I was, you know, doing my thing, walking around the expo hall because my Sam Potterworth meeting group, whoa. My Sam Potterworth meeting group was at 5, and I had gotten there at 10, and mind you, every day I had an ice cream cone to keep me hyper, and that didn't work out a little too well. But I met, um, there's a channel called Makers and Bakers that I, I don't think they're already out yet, but they're gonna be out with a whole bunch of, um, DIY and baker YouTubers, and I met one of the baker YouTubers, and I got a bag full of baking stuff, but then we were talking and then I said how I wanted to get into acting so she filmed me on her channel I can't remember her channel right now at the top of my head but yeah so I'm in someone else's videos and then I'm walking around the actual hall for because I'm bored and that was the time Allie met Allie me Allie meeting Allie cat Allie and Panders but Panders is on a leash and we're not gonna finish because it kind of looks like some weird thing but then I'm walking around and I run into, I see Alex James taking pictures and the day before I saw him I was in line to take a picture but he had to do a panel, had to leave. But today and then the next day I was like, Oh wow, I don't think he has any more panels to do, so I'm just gonna meet him and well he is like another giant, so we're taking our picture, he has his the cam my phone up like this and bending down but I'm so sure it's not even funny. So yeah. And then I have my Sam Potterworth meet and greet and yeah and there's this one YouTuber that I've been watching since I was in 8th grade after his ghost installs video and I got my other friend hooked on him but I, it's the last day I'm tired I didn't want to do anything else they just closed the expo hall so I'm walking outside with my little ice cream cone and I see the dimples of Ol Olin Rogers and I nearly dropped my ice cream cone, like, I was so starstruck, like, I nearly dropped it. So he's coming in, I'm going out, I literally just stop him, like, I go to the side of him, but I was like, oh, real quick, can we just take a picture, and we did, and oh my Jesus, I was so close to the dimples, I wanted to poke it, but I didn't want to be weird, so I didn't, and, yeah, um, oh, no, there's one more, so there's this, he's like my second favorite ginger next to Ed Sheeran, and his name is Chase, he's another Viner, I was outside, you know, sitting out there for a couple hours because I was too tired and my body was hurting from walking around. Too much physical exercise. But I'm just sitting there and I see his orange hair. He's talking to another friend. So I go up and 
wait and then I asked him for a picture and I did and had another little moment but then I'm sitting down and I see this blonde hair of an old lady Lance T10's grandma and then I saw Lance T10 and I was like you know what no you could get you look like a potato and I don't want a picture with you potato so I just let him walk by just let him get stuff by other people and just went out with my afternoon I also saw the guy who sang chocolate rain but I didn't it was literally at the time of the day where I was like, I know the YouTuber, I love them, but is it really worth it to get up from my comfortable spot to go take a picture? Well, it wasn't, so I didn't. And those were all the YouTubers that I remember meeting. And yeah. So, um, I will talk about, okay, I have two, one more Vidicon related, well, Technically two more, but I have basically one more VidCon related video that will be out Monday when I get back on Saturday. I'll film it. Then I have to talk a little bit about the other Carter situation that happened at VidCon. So that will be Wednesday. And I have two more videos I need to talk about. One is going to be for the little freshies that are starting school soon. And the other one is just going to be a little mini vlog where I need to talk about something. So, until then, you are getting another unedited video. I'm sorry. But, I love you all, and I'll see you guys later. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Um, if you want to see more of my face, you can subscribe to my channel. And all my social media links will be in the down bar below. But, until then, I'll see you Monday. Bye-bye.